All right, synapses are going to be a big topic of next week, the details of synaptic communication. Um, I want to show you this week though, a little more detail of three main types. And these are all types I've mentioned already. They're just some nice, nice pictures of them. So here are the ways that neurons can synapse one with another neuron, right? I mentioned this already. Um, here's neuron one receiving information, electrical signal traveling this way. And if we zoom into this location here, I'm actually gonna do that. We'll see what will be the focus of next week. Move myself, come on, move. Um, we're gonna see the presynaptic neuron. So this is neuron one. Here is the presynaptic membrane. It would be the blue right there. And it is synapsing with a postsynaptic neuron, neuron number two. That's gonna have a postsynaptic membrane. This is a type of synapse right here. This in between, actually I think it was what this was labeled to, is called a synaptic cleft. It's gonna be really important because that's where neurotransmitters will be released to transmit the signal to the, the next cell. They don't actually go all the way in. So I actually don't like that. They're gonna go into the synaptic cleft and bind to a receptor. So that's one type of synapse. Another type is going to, it is one you've already seen, neuromuscular junctions, right? This is a motor neuron. Um, it's going to synapse with a skeletal muscle. Saw this last week, right? So if we zoom into this a little bit more, I don't think I have a more zoomed in than, than that. Neuromuscular junction is where those um, axon terminals contact the sarcolemma of the motor neuron. And that is going to cause ultimately contraction of the, the skeletal muscle, okay? And here is another type, neuroglandular synapses. So this is the other stuff. Um, I also mentioned adipose, but that's more specific. So neurons can also synapse onto glands. Same thing here, this is a type of synapse. This gland, so, so what is it? What's it gonna do? It's gonna release hormone. So this neuron is going to cause the release of um, hormone via this synaptic communication here. So this is another way that, another type of synapse. 